The day started like any other, but unbeknownst to the young Nicholas Neville Michael Macmillan, it was going to take a turn that would forever etch itself into his memory. The stage was set in an old Russian embassy at Quarantine Point, St. George, Grenada, West Indies, a place where Nicholas and his nine siblings frolicked under the watchful eyes of their mother, Ivar Macmillan. The Russian embassy wasn't just their home, it was a fortress girdled by a daunting electric fence, a barrier that held an air of mystery and danger for the young minds. Their mother, always cautious, had issued countless warnings about the perilous fence, yet the allure of the unknown was too potent for young Nicholas to resist. One fateful day, driven by curiosity, Nicholas found himself standing before the electric fence. The warnings of his mother echoed in his mind, yet he was drawn towards the electrified barrier. He reached out, placing both hands on the fence. In an instant, the fence clung onto him like a relentless magnet, sending shockwaves through his body. The world around him blurred, his heart pounded in his chest like a wild drum. He was in the grip of the fence, the current coursing through him, threatening to extinguish the spark of his young life. Then, in the brink of the abyss, an unexpected saviour emerged. A lizard, as if guided by some divine purpose, leaped onto the fence. Suddenly, Nicholas was released from the fence's deadly grip. The lizard, having absorbed the shock, turned to ashes, its sacrifice saving Nicholas's life. Nicholas fell back, his hands seared, looking like they'd been fried to a crisp. The fence, once a symbol of intrigue, now stood as a testament to the danger he had narrowly escaped. Uh, the electric fence incident was more than just a harrowing event. It was a turning point in Nicholas's life. It taught him the value of heed, the cost of curiosity, and the inexplicable ways in which life can throw us a lifeline. The memory of the lizard sacrifice and his fried-like KFC chicken hands would forever serve as a stark reminder of the day he danced with death and lived to tell the tale. From then on, Nicholas carried the lessons from this incident close to his heart. It shaped his perspective, making him more cautious, more respectful of the unknown, and more appreciative of life's unpredictable nature. The incident, in its own peculiar way, was a rite of passage for young Nicholas, one that marked his transition from a carefree child to a young man with an understanding of the delicate balance of life and death. In the grand scheme of things, the electric fence incident was a testament to the unpredictable journey of life, a tale of curiosity, danger, survival, and the unexpected heroes we find along the way. The incident was a stark reminder that life is a precious gift, one that can be taken away in an instant and sometimes saved in the most unexpected of ways.